this, I thought, if this is the case, if, the, if Moses wanted to correct the whole world, why did, why did he go out of Egypt? Why didn't he stay in Egypt and make the correction there? It symbolizes wanting to come out of the ego. Uh, first of all, if I'm in the ego, I have to let it go, get out of it, to be this way that I work completely out of love and bestow, free of my ego, taking the other force in the world. There are two forces, the force of reception and the force of bestowal. The force of bestowal is under the control of the force of reception, which is called the Egyptian exile. When the force of bestowal comes out of the exile and disconnects from it, it's called the people of Israel come out of Egypt and exist per se. When it exists per se, they exist per se, it's starting to connect with the Creator, it's called the state of Mount Sinai. After that, we can take parts of Egypt and gradually to connect them, and this is what we wanted to do. He also connected to himself, the mixed multitude, and to this day, we're in a struggle. I see. Is, is this in any way parallel to what's happening today, where you have Jews concentrated in one, one space? Are they supposed to do the same thing that, that the people of Israel did with Moses and then pass it on to the rest of the world? Is it the same in any Jews. way? Jews. No, the Jews in Israel. Are they supposed to do what, what, the, what the, the Jews did with Moses? Yes. Jews and, and uh, all the Kabbalists, the recent Kabbalists, Kabbalists of the 20th century, they read about this, that we have received permission to come back to the land of Israel only on condition and are to have a country here like any other people and live like we do today, but only for the purpose of unity. If on this opportunity that still exists, we will realize the connection will set an example for all Jews around the world and for the nations of the world, how to create a connection and get out of all these problems and the life that is becoming worse from one day to the next. How can we transcend to the degree of godliness reveal and open a whole and perfect life, but that's on condition that people here in the land of Israel will start now realizing the unity between them, where then that unity, the higher force will reveal itself and the whole world will start coming closer to it. Mm -hmm.